Hello and welcome to the Charlotte Hornets match review for the Charlotte Hornets vs Boston Celtics game in which the Hornets win an awesome game, awesome showcase of Hornets basketball on national television in Boston. So um, coming to this game, the Hornets were 24-20 and 20 and now extended their record to 25-20 and 20 with a 111-102 win over the Boston Celtics. Um... The Hornets down the stretch really lent on Terry Rozier to hit some clutch threes. Lamelo Ball hit a huge shot as well. Also, Miles Bridges had a really nice stretch, about three baskets in a row, I believe. Just tough finish after tough finish. Um, yeah, Lamelo had a really ups, uh, interesting game. A triple double, fifteen points, ten rebounds, ten assists, but eight turnovers, which is a crazy amount of turnovers um, for Lamelo. At least, um, Terry Rozier with 28 points, 10 assists as well, which is huge, I think. Miles Bridges was awesome for his 22. Um, yeah, I don't really, yeah, he, his three ball wasn't falling, but I was happy when I seen him attacking. I was like, yeah, that's good. Um, that's good work. Plumley had four offensive rebounds, which I really liked. Um, we had Kelly Oubre, awesome spark plug off the bench, 18 points for KO. Hit some big threes, three or seven from there. McDaniels also had some huge shots. Um, him and Washington defended well, I thought. Um, yeah, so did Cody Martin as normal. Um, for the Celtics, it was a story of how cold Tatum was. He shot 5 of 19 from the field. That never helps. Um, Grant Williams wasn't very good. Neither was Josh Richardson, who's been having a really good year um, for his standards, really. Um yeah, Romeo Langford at 11, Al Horford double-double, hit some hit a couple of threes which hurt, but yeah, and Tatum went 0 of 7, Jalen Brown 2 of 11 from 3, um, so yeah, that helped the Hornets in that regard, but got it done down the end of the game, which was awesome to see, and the Hornets take a real big victory. Um, keeping them in seventh place in the Eastern Conference, the two games clear of Washington now, who are in eighth. So it's nice um, for the Hornets. Hornets are twelve and six at home now, thirteen and fourteen on the road, um, which is good to see. Hornets are coming up against the game, coming up with a game against the OKC Thunder at the Spectrum Center. So looking forward to that one, seeing if they can make it another win. Because it was a really impressive game for the Hornets. And I really enjoyed it. National TV showcase game. And the Hornets actually really did step up and played Hornets basketball. So yeah, that will be your Charlotte Hornets first Boston Celtics match review. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like and subscribe. I will be back with you sometime soon for a match preview of the Charlotte Hornets vs OKC Thunder game.